You know, I am going to flip to you so people can see your wonderful glasses mm. <laughs> at some point. <laughs> yeah. I'm still trying to get a chat up so I can see the chat, but it's seeing no one here while I so Yeah, I can see the chat. <coughs> sure. well, live, live chat this time. So to talk yeah, chat. I'm having technical <laughs> difficulties. Good day, Crafty Gems. It's uh, Nikki and Anne Marie here. We um Hi. Yeah, we were gonna have Michelle, but she's not feeling too good, so thank you, window defender summary. <laughs> <laughs> I was just going to see that. Yeah, was that you or me? Yeah, that was me. Oh, oh, why does it do that? It just wants you to know that it's you with us as well, because I said uh, Nikki and Anne Marie, and it, my uh, computer wanted to let you know it was here as well. <laughs> AI. Okay. Firefox is not responding. <laughs> So uh, today I'm going to be um, altering this uh, this cross, and um, what I've done is I've stuck six um, layers of cardboard. Hi, Susan. Uh, Amory's here too. Susan and Gerald. Have you got chat up yet? Uh, hi, Susan. I'm having technical difficulties, so I can't really see what you're saying yet. <laughs> <laughs> What's really funny is that Amory just waved to you and she's not on the screen. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> I always do that. But... Oh. Yes. Yeah, so, so I've so I've cut six of these uh, um, cardboard cross shapes, and uh, what I did was I cut I um, folded it in half to make sure it was symmetrical, and then cut the shape out. And then um, just cut round it and got six shapes out there and set them together and I've already gessoed them and it, they're nice and firm. Ah. Very firm. So um, if this turns out any good, it'll be going up on my wall. <laughs> cool. Susan says hi there, Annie. Hi. So yeah. So I'm just looking through some things to see where I want to get started on this one. So I've got my cup of tea. Do you want to see Amory with her super duper glasses on, anyone? <laughs> you can't really see them, it's all glary in here. Yeah, I'll just I'll just switch to you and we, we can all see you with your glasses. Uh, although you have shown them on your channel anyway, haven't you? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. There you go. Super. <laughs> Say hi. Like smart and intelligent. <laughs> <laughs> oh, coming back to me. <laughs> there we go. That was lovely. Oh. Susan says she's just glad you're seeing better. Let me yeah. when you, let me know if you get chat up. Yeah, I'm just I'm just getting ill now. Right. <clears throat> yeah, so I've just been getting a few things together because I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do. Um, I had a bath bomb at uh, Christmas, and I saved the little um bath bomb containers because I was thinking, oh, maybe I could use it as a shaker or something. So I've got the um. I'm not going to put a cake on there. <laughs> <laughs> See if I could get that off. So I was thinking that you know this could be something I could use on there. So we'll mm -hmm. just take that off, but it's quite a high dome. I don't have any miniatures or anything to put into it. It might have been nice to have some miniatures. So I might just make it as a shaker. There. There or there. <laughs> Haven't decided. So I'm just going through a few options now before I actually do anything with it. I want to put oh, this one on, but, but it's dented. Mm. It's dented, that one. So. Anywho. A few options with napkins. I'm just looking for some nice... Mm. Yeah, Susan says, looking great, Alan. Thank you. Sorry, I'm still trying to get this computer to work. It, it 
uh, I thought it was charging and it wasn't charging, the charger wasn't on and then it shut down and then it came up a message telling me I might need a new battery so I'm not too happy with that because that's going to cost me a bit of money but <clears throat> so I'm trying to get it loaded back up again now and it's clean yeah. <clears throat> yeah, I was going to, I was actually thinking about altering my glasses case, but I don't know. <laughs> it's quite nice too. Might use that on there. It's cute. Yeah. Uh, Susan says she's shaved, shaved, <laughs> saved a bunch of shaped packaging like that, and she doesn't know why. This is the reason why, it's so you can do shakers or put little miniatures inside on things. So that's why you've done it. Or <laughs> she can draw, draw around them as well. Yeah. Mm, yeah. Right, that'd be cute. I'm going to take off my little um, cat off there because he doesn't really go. But I am going to use this because it's got um, the text on there. So I'm going to use this as, to, you know, like a script stamp, but in tissue. So we're going to pop this on here too. I'll take away the green because the green's not going to go on there now. <laughs> Sorry, Michelle, no green on there. <laughs> well, well, maybe some of a grey green in there. I'll add a nice bit of colour. It's a great, like, um, Splatty kind of oh, that's uh, cool. I like uh, pretty. sort of splatty little this little bird there. <laughs> cool bird. Bird. Oh. Hey, I can see chat. Yay. If I'm not chatting, it's uh. because I'm eating shredded wheat. <laughs> oh, people are mm. eating shredded wheat. I don't eat like sweet sweet. No, not me. But then again, oh, then again, um, it's got gluten in it, so I wouldn't be eating that anyway. <laughs> mm. <coughs> At least I don't eat taggy today, Susan. <laughs> I tried to tag you last week, and then it wasn't until a couple of days later that I realised that I'd set it to only me. See when I seen it anyway. <laughs> because I had done like I took a picture of myself with the virtual glasses on and I shared the picture on Facebook and I was like, I'm just gonna put it only me just to see what it looks like. Yeah. And then I forgot to change it back to friends. So everything I was posting was only me and I was like, why isn't he able to reply to any of my posts? <laughs> <laughs> Um, I wonder why. <laughs> yeah, but I can't get all the di the difference with these glasses now. It's like when I've got them clean, when I can keep them clean, that is, it's like what a difference. I don't even realise how. Yeah, yeah. I'm all we know. I'm wearing my shoe. I sleep every four hours, a couple of hours, it seems. Uh, so do I, really. I slept, I had a nap today as well, but I've been getting up quite early in the mornings the last couple of mornings, and then I've been going out quite a lot as well, like shopping with my friend and stuff like that, it, since it's been sun, really sunny here, but it's rained today, so I stayed in today. But... And I had a nap to try and catch up and some of my sleep. And I knew about steaming tonight, so it's like I better try and get a sleep so I'm constantly <laughs> yawning. Yeah. But 
uh, I've seen Stephen on uh, was it Friday, Thursday, Friday. Yeah. Friday, I think it was. I I went shopping with my friend on Thursday. I uh, Thursday it was, and then I went shopping. Well, I didn't get much though. Shopping with my brother yesterday as well. Well. Mm -hmm. Oh no. But I was out all day on Wednesday because we went we went up to one of the shopping centres and then we went into Pizza Hut for lunch. So we had a buffet in Pizza Hut and then we went to Primark. I call it Primark, I know it's Primark, but I call it Primark. Um we went to Primark and uh, got, he got some clothes and then we went to the pub for a few drinks. And then we came home and we went to the kebab shop and got chips and cheese. <laughs> Susan, <laughs> Susan says it'd be nice where she is, getting hot as well. Yeah, it's been really hot here. I like Wednesday. Oh, I, could, I was like, I thought I was going to faint on Wednesday. It was that hot. Because my neighbour, well, it's my neighbour, my friend, he was actually like to go to the beach. And I didn't feel I didn't feel great because I was I didn't get much sleep and then Pippi woke me up at four in the morning because she was sick. And um I so I was I, I had a couple of hours of sleep so I was so tired and I just felt that dead groggy way. Yeah. So I was like, I really can't be bothered sitting in a beach mm -hmm. and not feeling like this, so we just went shopping instead. No, but not many people know that um, Scotland has some wonderful beaches. Mm -hmm. You know, so <clears throat> so white and pristine. You know, the sand is just amazing. Yeah, I mean, I've, been, I've been to some beaches where all the beaches are pink and things like that, and then you you get to Scotland, and some of the beaches there are just like pure. You know, the sand looks pristine, beautiful. No. Cold, <laughs> but beautiful. Yeah, cold. <laughs> oh, that was what I was thinking because it was so hot, and I was like, the beach is going to be like completely mobbed because everybody will be like, go to the beach. So I was like, I really don't want to be sitting in amongst tons of people because, like, for the last week or so, my anxiety has been a bit high. Yeah. So I was like, I really don't want it. Although shopping was just as bad because there was a lot of people around there, but it wasn't too bad. Um, but I was like, I don't like sitting around a lot of people when my anxiety is so high. But yeah. So, we just went shopping. But it was a good day out, you know what I mean? I enjoyed myself, it was good. Yeah, my, um, <laughs> my son's girlfriend came for a visit yesterday. She oh, nice. Yeah, she was at the um, she was in Christchurch here at the um Chinese embassy getting a visa for my son to go to China because mm -hmm. they're on their holidays on Tuesday. She's going back to see her mum and dad. Uh huh. So taking him to uh to meet the parents. <laughs> oh <Jeez. man. laughs> So yeah, so while she was in Christchurch, she um. She didn't stay with me because she's quite an independent girl. Obviously, she spent years travelling on her own, and uh, so she stayed with friends. But she uh, she hopped on the bus and came came down to see me. Yeah, oh, so that's nice. Yeah, it's uh, about an hour's bus ride. So uh, and I met her off the bus, and uh, she spent the afternoon with me. We had a nice a nice and um, gentle afternoon together. It's lovely. Oh, she was a yeah. sweet, sweet girl. Susan Sasson, is she Chinese? Yes, yeah. She's Chinese, yes. Yeah, she's a sweet and gentle girl, she is. Well, I shouldn't say girl, she's a woman. But, you know, <laughs> same age uh, as my son. So, um, uh, I'm sorry. Yeah, woman. Girl woman. Sorry, I'm just chatting. <laughs> I was still saying up in my shop they're doing these chewy sweets and I think they're from China but they're dead nice so they're called high chews. 
really nice. But they're one of the ones that you can chew it and chew it and chew it. And it you no, know, last ages, and it's got like a fruity kind of center. It's really nice, man. I've got a packet today. It's quite expensive though, but. Hi, Michelle. Hi, Michelle. Yeah. Susan says such a different culture, so they should get home well. Yeah, I hope so. She's from uh, Shanghai. So she said her mum already thinks my son is a sweet boy. <laughs> That's because she didn't know him yet. <laughs> Um, there he is, he's lovely. He's another gentle soul as well, actually. Yeah, I've been watching all the drama kicking off in the beauty community on YouTube. <laughs> do you watch beauty videos, do you? No, I don't watch it. I don't watch the beauty videos, but um, <laughs> I'm nosy. And um, one in my swimming community, the game that I play Sims 4. Yeah. So th they've got a swimming community. It's a gamer community. And um, one of the Simmers, which we call, that's what we call ourselves Simmers, um, had mentioned something about it the other day in one of the videos. And I'm like, She's like, oh, the tea's been spilt in the beauty community and all this kind of stuff. And I'm like, oh, I need to go do my nosy. <laughs> so, I was watching all the drama videos and all that kind yeah. of stuff. But I think it's starting to die down now because, like, the boy that was involved with it has actually, like, posted a video with receipts and um, with text messages and stuff like that and in his side of the story, so I think it'll maybe start calming down a bit now. It's like, oh man. Yeah, a bit, bit like a mixed change from the crafting community, isn't it? Mm. <laughs> oh dear. All that drama that went on there, hilarious. Mm. No, not hilarious really, I mean, women getting jealous of women and uh, being mm -hmm. as hell, man. <laughs> Just like, ah. Oh. Mm. Yeah. Glad to see that all died down there. Uh, until the next one. Well, until the next lot. Well, I love it. I don't see videos anymore, so, you know. Yeah. It's the same on the, the actual real life. Like, they've cancelled um, one of the chat shows here, Jeremy Kyle. Oh, yeah. Because someone committed suicide, did they? After? Yeah. So they've cancelled that now, so I'm gonna I'm gonna miss work because I usually watch that when I'm eating my breakfast, you know what I mean? Something to watch. I was gonna say surely it's not a huge loss. No, no, the, really. the, the program the program is what I mean, it's not a huge loss, not the um of course someone taking their life. I'm no, not, no, no. I'm not minimizing that, I'm minimizing the program. <laughs> yeah. Suicide is dreadful. Yeah, it is. Mm, yes. oh, puppy's a wee bit, thank God. Give me peace and quiet for a while. She's yeah. been sitting on the chair all day most of the day, so I just kicked her off it. <laughs> yeah. so Mama's got... tongue. So she's taken the hemp and uh, gone to bed, is she? Mm -hmm. I'm not in bed. No, I'm sure I'm not crafting. I'm not in to craft tonight. No, I'm not off the phone to my brother. He's not doing too good, so it's kind of put me in a bit of a meh. <laughs> so I was not really planning to craft it anyway, but that's just made me a bit meh.
He's like, phone me back in half an hour. I was like, I can't, I'm streaming. He's like, tell them you're phoning me back. Never mind streaming. Okay. <laughs> I'm all doing it. I need somebody to talk to. I was like, ah, ah, you'll be fine. You've got your friends in. You'll be fine. We've already spoke to you. <laughs> yeah, should have got him on here. No one would be able to understand him, probably. Oh, no, man. It was just embarrassment. <laughs> Of course, that's what brothers are for. Embarrassing their sisters. Mm. He's moaning at me because I've, I've got like 10 toilet roll tubes in my bathroom. Mm -hmm. he's, he's like, have you got rid of the toilet, <laughs> toilet roll tubes yet? <laughs> it's like, no. <laughs> Because he and he used my toilet the other week when he came up. I'm like, no. He's like, you're a pure water. <laughs> yeah. Well, I don't know, Michelle, but I hope so too. He's having a bit of a, a, a bad day the day. Susan so. says you can mute yourself and uh, phone him up, Sid, if it's important. Yeah. It'll just be what I thought of all the rubbish shoes and I've already spoke to him, so I'm going to go and visit him and hopefully Monday anyway and make sure he's all right. Give him lectures. Because <laughs> he's been daft, so he'll be getting lectures at me. Maybe a slap or two. I've been stupid. Oh. And then I phoned my sister and told her, and she's like, ah, I've got a right to phone him. And I was like, it's fine. Because they don't like it when he phones me and tells me stuff, you know what I mean? Because, like, they worry that I'll worry, do you know what I mean? So he doesn't, they don't like it when he phones me and worries me, do you know what I mean? But I'd rather he talk to me than no talk to me, if you know what I mean. And it's always it always seems to me be me that he talks to the most. So I think it's because the two is kind of we're quite close, do you know what I mean? And we've been through a lot together, so he talks to me more than he talks to like yeah. the other members of the family. Well, I think you're not judgy either, so you know, he knows he can tell you stuff and you're not gonna judge him for it. No. Nah. Um Oh, he's my older brother, Susan. But sometimes it, it feels like I'm the older sister. Because I'm more sensible than he is. <laughs> he and that's how he talks to me the most, because he knows that I'll tell him straight. <laughs> don't be stupid, do you know what I mean? But aye. Uh... Well, it's cold here. <laughs> it's cold. It's not, it's, I mean, it's been raining here, and it's been a wee bit cold, but it's not too bad, you know. But no doubt, you know what I'm like when I'm sitting at this computer, the zipper goes on, the zipper goes off, so. Yeah. It's because I'm sitting here, and obviously the heat for the computer and that and all. Mm. So I'm going to uh, use a bit of a stencil on you now as well, I think. It's looking good. Oh, but it's layering, isn't it? So layers, layers, layers. Uh, <laughs> I've got some yeah. um, ink on here, so as I put the moulding paste on, the ink will start coming off with it as well, which will give it a nice tint too. Yeah, yeah. I'm the, I'm the BB of the family. If my other brother does this. My other brother, he does the same and all. Like he rant to me and stuff and he's having stressful times and all he'll rant and stuff and I'll be like oh stop stop telling me all your problems <laughs> no i mean i i don't mind them talking to me but sometimes i'm like oh you know like one way i'm like i've got enough problems i know people say everybody else's because everybody knows it like when they talk to me, I take on everybody's problems. Do you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. It's part of your anxiety, and that, isn't it? Yeah. 
but I'm one of the, like, who's my friend did it once, she was going through a really hard time. And uh, she never told me about it until one night she broke down and told me, and I was like, I wasn't happy with her. And I was like, how did you know talk to me? And she's like, oh, I know you've got your own problems, you don't need mine as well. And I'm like, look, that's what I'm there for. And like, sometimes it's good because sometimes it takes some like, mind off your own problems because then you're focused more on helping your friends. I think mm -hmm. my case just had it. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, let's see if the, let's see if I can rescue any. So she got a ball looking that night. She gets shouted up because she never told me. Right, I think that's gone. <laughs> have to give oh, it some, have to give it some love a bit later on. I think it's because the clean film wrap had come and broken. Oh. Ripped. Oh well. Nice, nice dinner tomorrow with my bros. So I'm going to use, um, what shall I use? Shall I use gesso or shall I use a gel medium? This is the thing. Ooh. So I'll go with some gesso. I've got so many videos to catch up on. Like. I've just been watching all the TV shows. Yeah, and drama videos. <laughs> yeah. That's good. It's a shame that he's had to get the surgery though, but that's it's good that he's doing okay. Yeah, I'm just trying to clean these glasses again to keep getting all smudgy and smudgy. <laughs> I think that's the third time I've seen him do it. I know. It's really annoying, yeah. Yeah, because I can't see it them when they're all smeary. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm. Oh. Ouch. That's a shame. Would you just say it again? Just that. It's much too fine a uh, thing to go on there, so I'm going to try something else. Smudge that in. Give it a nice pink colour anyway. Mm -hmm. Gentle pink colour on the background. What did you say again, Michelle? So what young lad was this? It was a, a boy that was out at the playground. Oh. And he, he fell. Fell yep. off his slide and broke, broke his leg. Ooh. It's not good, is it? Mm. 13 years old. Yeah, I Ooh. thought that. I wasn't sure though. I remember you telling me what age you was, but I can remember. <clears throat> so we had to get surgery this morning, get wires put in. She will say that it looked like an elbow. Yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> That's bad. Mm. It was the girls that ran in and told her, because the girls were out with the boy. So Michelle had to go and see him and deal with it, basically. Is that a park right by you, is it, Michelle? Mm. No, no, it wasn't, it wasn't your son. Mm. 
Io sotto ho spento, sono uno. Oh, definitely buy one of the massage chills. <laughs> Me and uh, Louise are thinking about joining Aqua Aerobics. Yeah. So I'm quitting the smoking and um, the money that I save on that, I'm going to use it to pay for the classes. Yeah. Cool. Oh, right. I thought it was um, a friend of the girls, Michelle. All right. So how did you find out that he had surgery in that? Did you speak to his mum? You keeping in contact with him? Yeah. <clears throat> I was watching a tonic live the other day where they were doing a uh, it must have been yesterday they were doing a craft battle with two of the male presenters who um, aren't crafters and so they were making cards it was hilarious mm -hmm. <laughs> the one you know was using all, all the dyes and putting doing layers and things he's watched the, you know obviously being a presenter on there he's watched the uh, the girls and that do their Card, make cards and things so he, he has an idea and the other one is just like really hopeless he's got no <laughs> he's got no um eye for color coordination or anything and he, he started off with a big card and he ended up with a card that was something like this you know he started off with a big huge card and he didn't like it chopped it off chopped it off you know hated what he was doing and he got down to something that was like that <laughs> and it was, it was hilarious and they've given each other the, you know the uh the chat and <laughs> it, it just ended up being so funny and of course they're yeah. all they're all welsh so um you know when they get really excited the welsh accents really come through it's so funny yeah. no it was a tonic life yeah yeah it was non creative craft it was on their top tonic for life which is um their youtube channel so yeah Tonic Studios. Yeah, I've never watched Create and Craft. People moan about it all the time, don't they? Mm. Yeah, watched it, yeah. stuff being out of stock and whatever. So, because they were on Ho Chanda TV, which I believe is must be like another Create and Craft TV, but uh, and then they moved to Create and Craft. So um, people were moaning about it like no end. So <laughs> I have no idea. It's like I don't even know, know why they're moaning because I don't know either of those channels if they're on TV. There was no such thing when I was in the UK. Mm. Right, I'm just going to have you have to sub it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Tell, it, tell him I sent you. <laughs> mm. Yeah, I sometimes do their, um, they do a, uh, a live showing, you know, the cards that people have created on their um, Facebook group. So I sometimes enter cards into that as well. 
get the card shared on their channel. Just so I can hear my name being said. <laughs> See, they've changed the Cool Cat Club group thing to Secret to Close now. Yes, yeah. Close to Secret, wasn't it? No, Secret to Close, I think it was. Wow. I don't know, let me check. I'm yeah, sure it was close to Secret. I hate it when people post you about their cats dying and that. So sad. Mm. I know. So in the UK, you can That's see on Roku. And I have no idea what Roku is as well. <laughs> no, not that. I've heard that. I've heard a bit, but uh, yeah, I don't know what it is. Where is it you are again, Susan? <laughs> what are you laughing at? <laughs> Somebody shared a picture on that cat group. And it says, tonight we're having bump perus protes for dinner and it's a cat we are parote we see sting with a parote stuck you see did it and marie i have no idea what you just said <laughs> <laughs> it's like it looks it's p u r r i t o s yeah paritos right well they've got a picture of a cat and its head sticking with one of the peritos. <laughs> and it says tonight we're having burnt peritos for dinner. Okay. Michelle said she didn't understand what you said either. Ah, these are peritos. Can you do share screen on your thing? No, I don't think so. Yeah. I was going to say, we can share your screen and show us. <laughs> so that's that's a burrito instead of burrito. Yeah, burrito. Burrito. <laughs> I don't even know how to share the screen. I don't know how you do it. Oh, okay. Hi, Pauline. Hi, Pauline. How are you, Han? <laughs> Still giggling away there. <laughs> Somebody's posted. I've not watched the video, but it looks like the cat's hitting it. And they've put, okay, can someone tell me why my cat is always doing this to a piece of art I have made? I'm so confused. It's not like he can see his reflection, reflection in it either. He doesn't do it with anything else. And somebody wrote underneath it, tough critic. Uh, yeah, I saw, I, saw, I saw that with the cat. Do the um, you know, the pouring on it, wasn't it? Yeah. Well, it's behind glass. Like it's behind glass, so I mean, obviously, you can see his reflection. It's actually a yes, it's in a frame. Yeah. Hi, Deborah. Oh, hi, Deborah. Yeah, Amory and I belong to um, the Cool Cat Group. <laughs> well, we 
post pictures of our cats or see um, other people uh, post pictures of their cats doing insane mm. things. <laughs> Did you see they've got a sister site as well, a cool pet group? No. Ah, they've got a cool pet group as well for people with cats and budgies and dogs and stuff like that as well. Yeah, because you're only supposed to do um, post pictures of cats on that group. Mm -hmm. Well, that, that's how I've opened the other one, cool pet group. Yeah. <laughs> Somebody's posted one with a cat hiding under a bra. Oh, no. Millie's not impressed by my partner throwing a bra on her. <laughs> It's amazing some of the pictures that people get either cats and their cats but in it, man. I still yeah. get good pictures of puppy. Pauline says, Hi, Anne Marie, did you see? Yes, yes. Did you I see said hi. hi back? Um, yeah, sorry. Yes, I said hi as soon as you came in. I'm concentrating, so mm -hmm. seeing and hearing nothing. Terrible, and it gave me rose when I said hi. Said it as soon as you said it. Yeah. She's so bossy. <laughs> I am. So bossy. Yeah, so my um, son's girlfriend was saying that uh, that lots of her friends now are. Uh, um, choosing not to have babies in China. You know, you know they have a government thing about, uh, you know, where they were only allowed to have one baby in that. And uh, a lot of that generation are choosing not to have babies. Mm. Is it one baby? I thought it was two. No, just one. They were allowed one. See, stuff like that, I think it is a shame, but at the same time, like, I think they should incorporate that law to, like, you know, the other countries that are, like, Bosnia and all that kind of stuff, with all the, the other countries with the, that struggle, you know, like, with the babies and stuff. I think that they should incorporate that, incorporate that over there as well. <laughs> what? <laughs> Do you agree? Know <laughs> yeah. Which true? There are too many people on the planet, but I still think it should be choice. Ah, it should be, but like, if and the way I see it is if there and, is. And, so and if you're going to do that, it shouldn't just be the countries that are struggling. It should be every every country. And then I wouldn't have been born, and you know, you wouldn't have been born, and. If you think about it now, you know, you wouldn't have been born, I wouldn't have been born because I'm a middle child. <laughs> mm. And you're the baby, so you wouldn't have been born. And yeah. And so, some, some religions believe that the more children you have, the closer to heaven you get, don't they? So, you know, it's like, um, yeah. In an ideal situation, we wouldn't have a problem maybe they need to like spread out populations more so that um you know so that the problem is isolated in single countries and uh, i don't know or grow more food or you know i don't know it's not up to us to uh, relieve world poverty or <laughs> I just let, uh, I'm talking rubbish now. Someone else talk. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you always talk rubbish. <laughs> <laughs> They've had zero population growth since the 70s or have been promoting it. I'm just going to sit here and whistle, Susan said. There you go. Yeah, they um and they call it uh, in China they're calling it big baby syndrome. Mm. This is what she was telling me yesterday. So yeah. Interesting. Mm. Interesting, you know. She says that, that she thinks it's because they were brought up in, you know, single child families 
and the children were so spoiled and given everything they wanted that as adults they can't cope and uh, and don't want to give that attention away to an to a baby of their own and so they're calling it the big baby syndrome um. see the conversations i have with my uh, <laughs> my do daughter to be daughter-in-law to be crazy huh yeah. <clears throat> oh i need to start getting ready with the donkey that's so strong oh. it's like <sighs> too much stuff oh cute Nice. I've just been um, down, going through my things, you know, and getting rid of stuff, clothes that don't fit me and things like that. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do um, next week. I'm going to start because I'm planning to go out, uh, no, next week, the following week, and uh, get new clothes. So I'm going to have a look through all my clothes and see what's ruined and what's, you know. Hmm. Them out. I've told my sisters, like, don't let me buy any grey t shirts. <laughs> yeah, I've been, been through my china cupboards and everything. I've just been doing a huge downsizing again, getting rid of stuff, you know. I need to get rid of my right. plates as well. I've got too much plates, man. It's only be here, and I've got like 10 or 11 plates. It's like, <laughs> oh, I like empty bowls and saucers and forks and knives and oh, I need to get ready, I Yeah. It's just getting the motivation to do it. <laughs> yeah, I was thinking of my, um, you know, some of my um, uh, Mormon friends and that, you know, who have large families because of their religion, being closer to God, and the larger family you have, the, you know, the better it is for you and it's like, oh. <laughs> That's crazy, but I know my 12 kids. Yeah. And then, of course, some religions, it's um, to do with um, birth control and why they have large families. In the past, it used to be, of course, there was no, you know, no real thing as birth control. But now you do. So... I was only four, four in my family. My two brothers, my sister and me. Well, there would have been five, but my mum had a still born, so. Yeah. But the thing is, is that in the past, you used to have large families because you, um, children, you used to lose a lot of um, children in the early years, you know. Child mortality, infant mortality rate was huge. So, yeah. Yeah, look at that. Years ago... Most Irish families had over 12 or more children, 14 on on my mammy's side and 12 on my daddy's side. My parents too, and number eight of nine, Susan, wow. Mm -hmm. Didn't know that Mormons thought that. Yeah, no birth control back then. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, you used to have lots of children, of course, obviously, because they... Um, they used to work in the fields and that for you and uh but uh just just to make babies instead yes okay i'm <laughs> it's true but i don't want i'm not saying anything it's no it's true I'm one of five, Michelle, so, you know, up there as well. The hus husband's one of five. Yeah, well, I mean, as a country, you know, to control the population is uh, no one would have even bothered to think about um, uh, the psychological effect of it had. And, uh, but it was only the families in the cities, people in the countryside could have larger families. Because of course you need you need that to work the land. I uh, make that's uh, to help with the farming and yeah. 
That's what I do in the Sims. I make them have big families so all the kids can help the bombs and stuff. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Ooh. It's like everybody talks about how, like, with my mum and that, like, my birthday's New Year's Day and my brother's on Boxing Day and then my other brother's, like, the 7th, the 5th, uh, 7th of January, so we're all quite close. <laughs> 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 and then we all lost sisters in July. So your dad was a kind of once a year kind of guy, was he? Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, six and a half years between me and my sister. Yeah. She was the last baby before me. So six and a half years. So I was in an accident. I was in a mate of Harton. Just going to dry this off a bit. Just chat. I think more religious voice done. Indonesian man, it's called I don't know. I'll have you lifting cuts. I feel sorry for the mothers though, man. Like seriously. I couldn't even imagine having one of my fifteen. <laughs> It's like one of my neighbours, she had like seven, I think it was, because mm. she was trying for a boy and it was all like every time they dingied, it was all glasses. She kept trying for a boy, man, and we kept saying to her, you go, stop. <laughs> my cousin, she had three girls, three, is it three girls, four girls? You see, you know. Four girls. She wanted a boy, but it turned out her daughter had a boy instead, so she's got a grandson. So she's still got a boy. Oh. Yeah, it's very interesting um, talking to, you know, someone who's been through it as a family and what the family gives up for the child and yeah it's it's not that no it's like how they it's like mostly chinese people are all dead smart and brainy i know aren't they? it's like they're all like tech people and making inventions and they're all dead smart and brainy i yeah. used to have a yeah, that, that, that that's the um, that's the pressure that's put on them, though, isn't it? Mm. So I used to have a Chinese pals at school. I had a few actually. His name was Quan Yu, mm. and I shouted on him. I was out playing one day. I was out with my mum, and I shouted on him one day. I was like, Quan Yu, and my mum thought shouted, "I love you." <laughs> Yeah. No, he seems quite new. Oh my god. I don't think that's true. I don't think that's true, Susan. No, it is. It's true. That's true because um, my sister used to work in a, um, or they kept you at the country. Because uh, my sister used to work with work in a Chinese shop, a takeaway shop, and I, the, the woman that worked there told her. That's horrible. Ah, that's true. That's what they do. Because like, it's basically against the law to have a second child. So they basically um, kick you out the country, or as Susan said. I I couldn't believe it when my sister told me either. I was like, no. She's like, aye. Wait, you have another uh, thingy. 
that's horrible. If that, if that is actually true, that's horrible. Mm -hmm. If that's actually true, that is horrible. Yuck. That makes me yeah. feel horrible even thinking it. Yeah. That's how, that's how so many Chinese people move move out the country. So that they can go to different countries so they can have more kids and without having to worry about the consequences, do you know what I mean? That is, it's horrible. Because it's against the law, basically. No. So that's a punishment. No one is. That is not nice. It makes me uh, feel yuck just thinking of it. Mm. It's crazy what so many of the other countries have as a laws, man. It's no punishments and yeah, you know, it's, it's no, no right, man. But then again, you come to this country and it's like people do like bad crimes and they only get a short time, and then the time they get, they can get out and parole in a couple, you know what I mean, less than the time. It's, Oof. The world's more nice. <sighs> I don't know. I don't know if they have changed it, Michelle. But I know that's when it used to be like that. Anyway, I know that it's true that it used to be like that. But I don't know if they've changed it now. We get from honey cat videos to this. What what did I say? I must stop. It's you. <laughs> Let's change the subject. <laughs> it was you. You brought it up. Oh my god. <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> Someone quick, someone in chat think of something nice to talk about. <laughs> We talk about this look, and I've got baby little cherub things on my. <laughs> mm. Oh man, that's weird. Oh wait, China announced at the end of a hugely controversial one-child policy on Thursday after <clears throat> decades of strict, sometimes brutal enforcement left it with an aging population so I uh, well they must have stopped it then that was in two that's post for 2015. Mm -hmm. All couples will be allowed to have two children. Two? Wow. <laughs> but the decision comes too late for generations of Chinese people in countries with difficult value and social safety nets. change the subject. Although it's worth, you know, talking about let's change the subject because it's no longer law now. So there you go. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Just showed you, don't it? Hi Debbie. Hi Debbie. <laughs> we 
you're all quiet now. <laughs> oh, that's good. Michelle says the girl oh, done that. Yeah. And and our cultural day. So when your girls do New, Zealand, do New Zealand, Michelle. Or is it someone else asking me about New Zealand food and things? <laughs> is it someone else? Someone was asking me about New Zealand because they're for their girls learning about different countries. Might have actually been Eileen now I think about it. Roman Lithuania. Hi Debbie, the big winner is here. The big winner. Someone won something. I gave you one your giveaway, didn't you? That was ages ago, yeah. And oh, she's still a big winner, isn't she? Oh, right, okay. <laughs> I was thinking, yeah, that was ages ago, though, Susan. Yeah, it must be like 55 sub years ago. <laughs> Yeah, maybe. <laughs> maybe one might give away. Yes, she did. Ages ago. <laughs> I'm buffering. Yeah, so long ago, I've forgotten all about it. <laughs> Italy. What about Italy? Well, Roman Lithuania and then Italy for the um, International Day. Two feet up, two pulled. Mm -hmm. Someone will want to do this shit. And get two pulled. I was going to have a drink last night, but I decided no way. Yeah. Yeah, I need to work on my December daily. <laughs> The shoes almost half over, about time to start. <laughs> Christmas crafts, oh dear. Oh yeah, talking about Christmas crafts and that, Gareth has undergone his operation, hasn't he? Mm -hmm. oh, hope he's okay. Because mm. he hasn't been able to make videos and things and no talking and bless him. Been thinking about him actually today. Yeah, it sucks. Wondering where, when we're going to get an update from him. Michelle tell you it's about people one dollar a week. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, I was saying about bruises. <laughs> uh, she'll show you them all. And then something fell on her leg, man. You see the size of the bruise. Yeah. What was it? What what was it done again, Michelle? Is that a table or something? You had your leg over. Bruce the layers, Alina. Jeez, she's not wishing the flipping year away. Stop it. 
Ito. Aro, gusto ako sa summer eh, kuya. You lost in the UK. Ay, the door off the press, that's what it was. You should remember, she sees it. The cupboard door was broke. It fell on top of the leg, man. Gotta see it, Bruce. What? No, I don't know. I don't know yet. It might, it might be that dome thing. I just haven't decided. I haven't decided. You see um, a little rainbow coming through from my um, little charm in the window. No, oh. <laughs> mm -hmm. Sun's peeking through. Got some cute little um, glass baubles and crystals hanging up at the window. Yeah. I wouldn't be but hang it hang it up at the windy pub we'd be trying to catch it all the time. Yeah. Just like there's a hook out in my hall, up in the ceiling, and I was thinking about making like a dandelion thing for that, but she would just sit and cry because she couldn't get it. Mm. Or she'd be jumping up trying to get it. That's what she does with my shower. She jumps up and grabs the string in my uh, fan extractor. Tushy. Uh, jumps in at the bath and hits the the, the, the <laughs> potion. She's a naughty little thing, isn't she? <laughs> mm. She's in a mood with me because I've been out a lot the last couple of days. I'm leaving her in. Wednesday I was out for about seven hours. The two of you just had a wee chill out there the other day and you're laying on the couch and she came up and she's lay under the cover with me and then I must have been kicking her or something when I was sleeping because I fell asleep and oh. I woke up she was lying on top of the cover under the boat in the mess. Shall I go shabby or shall I do the... Um, shall I put a bit of material on there or shall I do the shaker? Shaker or material? Come on, guys. Give us a bit of a uh, read out on it. Not on. I would say material. Shaker, shaker. <laughs> oh, and shaker then. Uh, we we'll say shaker, shaker. Okay, here we go shaker, shaker, shaker. I want to see if I can do shaker in the, from this. Oop. Dropping it on the floor. Mm. I just don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Susan. <laughs> All right, and it was shaker put it's three against one, so everybody's seen shaker. Yeah, yeah. But then again, are you going to take it off the watch, shake it? Shake it, shake it. I put my wee plaque up in my living room as well. Yeah. I still need to get my button gear and make one for... Oh, uh, oh. Or shall I put one of my rosettes on there, look? <laughs> mm. uh, well, I was going to, that's what I was going to do there, is I was going to put like well, that that's on there. Quite nice, like that. yeah, then it's covering up the, the little cherry oh, no, thing actually. there. I can actually move them down because I've still got a, uh, still got these here, look. I actually like that, Nick, it's nice like that. What do you think? Yeah, I like that too, actually. The colours came right for that, didn't they? Ah, oh, it's nice, I like that. that that's the big one as well, isn't it? Yeah, it is. It's the big, the big one. 
because I was wondering what to do with this, you know, because the smaller ones are getting sent out in a um, in a, uh, a swap. And then I was wondering what to do with this one because I added more and more to this one. I just went mad and added, mm -hmm. extra. you know, I've got quite little diamond hearts in there and then I added these extra flowers in there and then I put the stick pin in there and so yeah yeah people are seeing the rosé so <laughs> I feel like that as well yeah so just good to go isn't it man and I can put the where's the original cross Nikki? sorry where's the original cross where's the original mm -hmm. some how do you not get it? Oh, 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 yeah, so um, that's what I made this one out of, and I'll just fetch the inspirational piece. That way you can see where she got the inspiration from as well. Yeah, I like the rosé on it, it's nice. And the cherubs are cute as well. Oh, that's cool, isn't it? Yeah. That's where my inspiration came from. Did you hear that? Yeah. I took him out for a walk yesterday, so he's now he's actually sat out by the front door. <laughs> yeah, so he's like, out. <laughs> let me out. It's very yeah. unusual to hear him or not, because usually you don't get to hear him, he's quite quiet. Yeah. Yeah, he's not a noisy cat. So I'll just pop that in. He's constantly greeting. <laughs> yeah, I like my little cherub -y. Yeah. Um, so I'll put my little cherubs back on. Mm. Just because it's uh, the colour ghost, isn't it? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, you heard him. <laughs> so he says, is that your kitty? Pretty mournful. <laughs> yeah. Like, oh, oh, oh. oh feel so <laughs> Mum won't let me out. <laughs> yeah, I took him out walking. So it's the first walk we've had on lead for uh, quite a while now because he's got the back garden here, but he's getting bored with it. So I just mm. took him out walking yesterday. And now he, because he's been trying to escape through the front door anyway, and I trapped his little head in the door the other day. Ah, so he's talking. <laughs> So it's like a I had mama. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Shut the door on his head. On his little burger face. Oh, Pippi's just always behind the door, man. I keep I've got to like open my front door really slowly so I don't hit on the face because she sits right behind the door. Yeah. And then I've got to like say to her, move till I get in because she just sits there and you're like gonna move to open the door. Let me in. <laughs> it's a shame about Josie, Anna. Yeah. You poor Dory. <sighs> yeah, she showed me the dog who was the uh, father the other day. Mm. He's waiting outside the door, so um, he's going to be pretty upset, isn't he? No. I wonder if I wonder if animals know. Oh, I, I definitely. It's like my brother's dog um, and his mother-in-law's dog. He used to watch mother-in-law's dog as well. And as I say, Jake died. I think it was a Saturday. He get he get put to rest because um, he was riddled with cancer and um, and a couple of days later Pippi died. Oh, Pippi. Yeah. 
that's who Pip, well, it's Pip, but um, that's who Pip is named after. Oh. My brother's dog. Oh, I was heartbroken when he died because yeah. I knew him for when he was a puppy because he used to be my sister's dog. Yeah. And I held him when she brought him home in the car, you know what I mean? So he was my baby. He used to go to, his, he used to, go to my brother's every Sunday, get my dinner. And he used to come up, and he wasn't exactly a small dog. He was a lasso absolute, but he was fat. And he used to come up and sit on my knee every Sunday and sit with me. And I used to call it my Sunday cuddles. My brother phoned me at the back of six on the Monday when he passed and told me, oh, I was heartbroken. I was like, come and get me. I'm, I want to come run and see him. He's actually buried in um, his mother-in-law's garden with Jake. Yeah. But I definitely believe in heartbreak, a heartbreak, a broken heart syndrome with dogs. Definitely believe in that. Well, dogs and cats, you know what I mean? Definitely believe in broken heart syndrome. It's a famous dog, isn't there, in Scotland? Josie, we were just talking about oh, you. Josie. <laughs> Hi, hon, how you doing? How's Dory doing? We were actually just talking about her. Your ears must have been burning. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, poor little thing. Mm. I should be ready for bed. <laughs> of course. Mm. Of course. You're late tonight. It's what, midnight there. I don't know. How's the kitchen coming along? Or is that a no talk subject? Uh oh. <laughs> She's doing great. Oh, that's Aww. good, that's good. She looked so sad in the yeah. photograph. You're a hug for me. Oh, baby. Made me all sad seeing that picture. I was like, whoa. Oh, So I'm wondering about putting some gilding flakes on here as well. I'm going to bring up the uh, little cherubs there a little bit better with painting. Yeah. Might do some gilding on there. Mm -hmm. Cool. Uh, but I need to dry it off a bit first before I do that. Well, I'm all right, you know, you know. We'll take your time. Yeah, good. Thanks. I don't know we've got Stevens too. Late one more late in the after. I don't go dead early now. I usually go late in the afternoon now. Okay. So I can get a long life. Mm. I cry so much when I had to say goodbye before she went. Oh, oh I, I feel I feel you, Josie. Well, you know what I was like when I had to put Pippi in to get her neutered. I can't, I can't imagine. But, you know what I mean? It's like I was the exact same. God, I get it all day when I, I had to get Pippi in. Until I go or back. Oh, baby. Yeah, I'm glad she's doing well as well. That's good. Good to hear. Getting lots of mummy cuddles. So I was just saying, Pippi's in the mood with me because I've been out for the last couple of days. All day. <laughs> Leaving her in. 
so she's not talking to me really. Was she, well, she been a suit today? Because I've stayed in today. But she's in a mood. She's in a wee carrier box because I kicked her off the chair. <laughs> <clears throat> My glasses are annoying me, Josie, they keep getting dirty and it. it's like every time I try to clean them they go, go uh, smeary, it's annoying me, I shouldn't even be wearing them now because I don't need them. Yeah, it is, it's pretty. She's, we had to debate there because she was going to put a dome on it with a shaker. And then she's like, because she'd have put material on it. <laughs> so we ended up, she put a rosé on it and it looked nice over. She's going with the rosé, a rosé or whatever you call it. I don't know if you call it a rosé or a rosé, I keep forgetting. I think it's a rosé, isn't it? Yeah, it's rosé. Thanks, Josie. Rosette. Rosette. I am going to have to, um, yeah, I'm going to put some gold on it now, some gilding. That's actually quite quick, Josie, because Pippi was in for quite a while. Mm. Two hours so later. That's actually yeah. quite quick. Right, I. Right, okay, so how would I how would I go about washing it? How'd I wash it? Just with water or do I need to wash it with a product or what? It is definitely a cloth it's staying. I even got one of the right. uh, cleaning solutions, you know, for the sprays, Michelle. But I don't know. Would I clean the cloth away? Do I just clean it with water or what? Sorry guys, just need not me there. Because I actually forgot to ask the woman in the shop what I clean it with. Because she said that and all she's like, it could be the cloth as well if the cloth's greasy. I don't know how it can be like greasy because I keep it in the, the case. Might have been. Well, that's what, that's what Nikki said as well, Jack, the tissue. Yeah. Right, don't use fabric softener. Right. Mm -hmm. It's just basically washing powder. I don't know what washing powder though. Right, mm -hmm. oh, well, I've seen a lot of YouTube videos where people are washing it with a uh, dish soap. But then other people are commenting saying, no, don't use dish soap because it takes half the protective lens or something, I don't know. Yeah, it depends whether your glasses are um, glasses or plastic, made from glass or plastic. Well, I don't even know why. It's, I don't know. Well, if they're heavy, then it's glass. If they're light, they're made from plastic. I think they might be plastic. Then, then they'll have a scratch resistant surface on it. Or like it's been so long since I've worn glasses, you know, like real proper glasses that um I don't know anymore. <laughs> don't know what they make them with anymore. I was just got all these questions because I've never you both them either. <laughs> Stephen says he's got a cloth that he got off of Amazon that's made to be really good, so he says he would give me one, but so I'll see if he gives me it tomorrow. Because he says that the cloths that come with the glasses are rubbish. So he says he's got a cloth that he got off Amazon. So he says he would give me one. I don't use liquid either, but Michelle, I only use the tablets. 
Dukes, Jill, Tarbottoms. I might just buy a wee cover non bio um, powder just for that because I was planning to wash some of my puppy's beds and stuff like that as well. With them, and I know you need to really use non non bio stuff for the cat stuff. Hi, Susan. Hi, Susan. So, yeah, I used to um, use, just wash, rinse them under the um, the tap. And uh, and rub them with my fingers and that until they were just like clean, and then mm. I, I just wipe dried them off in a tissue. Uh, I've got tissues. I've been and bought tissues yesterday. Yeah, but, but they mustn't be tissues, you know, that have that aloe in them or anything, you know. No, it's it's just normal just tissues at the pen shop, I think. Yeah, just a plain. Mm. Because I'm just scared to use certain things because like everybody's like, oh, it can cause scratches and it can do this. And can, I'm like, oh. Yeah, that's why you don't use a um, uh, kitchen towel because it's too, too abrasive. Mm -hmm. I've already hit the thumbs up, so I hit the thumbs up before the stream starts. All right, good night, Josie. I hope you have a good sleep. Oh yeah, night Josie. I'm going, going to my brother's tomorrow, but hopefully we can catch up on Monday or something. Or Tuesday even, because mm -hmm. I might go to the other brothers on Tuesday and Monday as well. Oh, you know, hopefully we can get a wee catch up. Oh, Michelle, you missed a good stream last week. What? Oh, my God. We were just laughing. <laughs> <laughs> that was hilarious, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. uh, Susan, you were here last week, weren't you? Susan Baker. Was it Susan that was here last week? I don't remember. I know Jude was here. It was Jude that was saying that yeah, one. Yeah, <laughs> man. <laughs> Words. <laughs> I told Michelle about it though. <laughs> yeah, we were talking about accents last week. Yeah, I thought you were here, Susan. I couldn't even remember though. It's just like, can't even remember half the things that I did yesterday in my mind last <laughs> week. Yeah. She's bad, man. <laughs> we came in right at the end. <laughs> that was yeah. funny, though. Nicky was mortified. <laughs> <laughs> so, oh my god, you made me say it. I was like, did I make you say it? I always get the blame. Of course. <laughs> you see me that thing with Michelle, I know you blame me for that and all. <laughs> that was funny though, wasn't it? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh... That's hilarious. Did you get uh, demonetised? I haven't actually bothered to look. <laughs> it's like, no, it's just too funny. I'm just going to leave it in there. I'm all right, Susan. I'm just about my toothache's playing up again, so but I'm all right. Susan says that is beautiful, Nikki. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Uh, she's, uh, she's got to put one of her rosettes on it as well that she made last week. So that's how there's two pictures of cherubs because one of them's getting covered up. <laughs> oh, I bumped my finger, well, basically my hand, a cracker they do. Yeah. 
pour boil on hot water on it. Oh. No, yeah, I hate it when that happens. It's calmed down now, though. It's all right now, but at the time, it was so... <laughs> I was making uh, spaghetti, and I don't even know how I managed to do it. I was holding a sieve while just colander, and then the pot, and I must have had my hand in the road, and I just poured it straight into the colander, and the hot water went all over my hand. But I was like, ow! I just ran it under the cold water, though, so it's, it's all right now, but at the time, it was just what? Like you wanna yeah. I don't cook. <laughs> I hate I hate this glue in that you put it on, you just let it go tacky and then you can't you don't know where you put the glue. <laughs> yeah, I've used that before that yeah. filled and stuff. Used it well, I was gonna use the flakes, but I decided no, just to go for it. it's easier to do the sheet. When to use the flakes. I think it was sheet that I used. I don't think I've used the flakes. Yeah. Golden sheet. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 So I say I was going to use the rub ones, man. I can never get the rub ones things to work either. Yeah. I thought, yeah, I thought I'd put a big blob somewhere, but I talked and then uh, <laughs> then I've kind of done it. <laughs> I think it was near the bottom you put some clue. Yeah. It's not there. Oh, you must have put it in one here. here. Maybe. God, I hate this tacky glue. I hate this glue. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, such a struggle to get out of the bottle. I thought you'd froze there. For me, I'm thinking. Mm. <laughs> you just went pure still. I thought you'd had, I thought we'd lost you. <laughs> I thought you did. <laughs> so you move, I'm like, oh, you're still there. Mm. Michelle says, keep the bottle upside down. Yeah. Yeah, I've done that before and uh, and ended up with a um, cup full of glue. So um, I don't keep bottles upside down anymore. <laughs> these little cherubs a little bit on my okay let's have a go I'm watching Master Chef Junior it's like I kind of cook to save myself but I like watching cooking shows I love watching uh, Gino DeCampo uh, videos on uh, from the Good Morning thing. My brother says that he's speaking his accent. <laughs> <laughs> it's like he's speaking that. <laughs> I like watching it because um, yeah, he's, he's got to be putting on the accent just a weeny bit more. Uh. That's what you see. He's like, he's faking that accent. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. 
Oh, I like it when he says things that sounds like other things, though. It's funny. Mm. I think he does that deliberately, I know. Yeah, of course, yeah. Of course. Because he knows he'll get away with it. <laughs> Cherubs, aren't they just gorgeous? <laughs> yep. Don't know what's up with me now, I just want to move to craft. Don't want to craft, what you say? Mm hmm? Did you say mm -hmm. you don't want to craft? Mm -hmm. I just don't want to move to craft. Yeah, did you see the road trip you did with Gordon? Yes. Ah, uh, yeah, it was funny. Um, with the travel tra in the trailer or whatever it was, caravan, and you kept, uh, yeah. kept crashing it and grinding it, and the flipping caravan was all beat up. And <laughs> uh, it was funny. But then he went and absolutely in the, the cliffs and all that, and they didn't need you. <laughs> <So stale. laughs> The whole region. <laughs> so, they, they got in the whiskey. Yeah. Has supposedly got the Ramsey's going to stay for me for most of these shows now? What's that? Supposedly, I've um, got the Ramsey's stepping away for most of these shows now. Is he? Mm -hmm. What's that? I uh, just he wants to spend more time focusing on other things. Ooh. I like Gordon Ramsay. He's actually from Scotland. Yeah. Some of these shows, but like that, catching nightmares, man. Some of the things they show, it's disgusting. Yeah. It's like, ugh. It just shows you, you don't know what's going on behind the scenes in catch, uh, restaurants. It's like, ugh. <laughs> oh, it's like his wife had a baby. Yeah, I love watching <laughs> see that MasterChef Junior at Summit does that as well. He's really great with kids, I think. He's actually quite good with kids. And I like doing that because the, the chefs all kind of take the mick out themselves because of the kids, you know what I mean? Like, they'll let them cover them in custard and everything. <laughs> The kids are cute as well. Yeah. But I watched that and I watched the I like the I like the Master Chef Australia one better than the the not like the American one. We oh, got okay. them I do still watch the one with Gordon Ramsay, but I prefer the Australian one. Right, okay. Uh, the chefs are much I just I like the chefs in that one. It's cool. And they do more stuff than they do in the American one, but no different challenges and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. so I like watching that. So that's no long starting Master Chef with Australia. You caught up with uh, Station 19 in Grey's Anatomy yet, Michelle? Or is it known yet to next week? She's mad at me because I'm a couple of episodes ahead of her. <laughs> and she's like, oh, that's not that I'm getting all excited about it. And I was like, uh, what episode do you watch? She's like, blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, oh, all right. 
She's like, oh no, don't tell me. I'm not telling you. She wants to, but she's not going to. Uh, I'm like, I'll just sit here and shut up. <laughs> well, it's funny because, like, Michelle's been watching it, like, from the beginning, right? And then I watched, like, I sat and binge watched all the seasons mm-hmm. and knew I'm ahead of her. <laughs> okay, Debbie, thanks. Have a good day Hi, yourself. Okay. Or rest yeah. of evening or whatever it is over there. Because <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Enjoy your day. Thanks for joining us. Oh, did you cry? <laughs> yeah, I can. He died. He was there. Yeah, she's like, she's like, oh, he's dead. Nice, isn't he? And I'm like, I'm like uh, what episode are you on? Because <laughs> I knew he died. <laughs> she's like, no, don't tell me he dies. Does he die? I'm like, I'm not telling you. <laughs> I so did I. I thought it was sad. I liked a bit um, where they all went up on the, the truck and all the wee thing. We did kind of mean their name there. And they all just lay in the truck there on the roof of the truck. But like, oh. <laughs> Ray's an atom, he's good this week and all. I just watched it earlier on. Well, I don't know if it's this week for you or next week. I can't remember now. I don't watch any of that, so... Oh, I like it. I like watching all that kind of things. Mm-hmm. Like, Grey's and that, my man, when I was watching it from the beginning, that and doing the binge watching, man, all I done was greet all the way through it. Like, oh, cussing Michelle for getting in to watch that. Yeah. <laughs> Did you get me to watch this? She's crying on it, right? I hate that though when you're watching a show and you get right into the characters and then they call the character off and you're like, oh. But they always keep the bad character in it, everybody hates. <laughs> or or they kill the character off and then they bring the bad you no, know, they kill the bad character and you're like, Yes, finally get rid of him. And then they bring the bad character back and you're like, seriously, they make up a reason to bring him back. Make it he's no died. <laughs> That's how I stopped watching all the soaps and all that man, because I was fed up with it. Wednesday night. Right, yeah. What happened in Grey's Anatomy last week though? So I know. Oh no, 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 right, okay, I'll not, I'll not say, I know, I know what episode you're on, right, okay. <clears throat> so, Grey's Anatomy that you watched last was the crossover, is that right? Nah, there they are. I was laughing at Matthew all day, I went down, and then I tell you, he's probably coming to stay. We were talking, was it last night we were sitting? And we were talking last night, and uh, he's like that. Ah, we're talking about soaps and all that, and he's like, oh, I don't watch your soaps. I was like, you liar, are you dead? I says, you sit and tell me all about it. <laughs> he's trying to make out these pills, he doesn't watch them. Oh, I meant to tell you, we were up, to, we went to Paisley on Friday, and uh, there was this guy, and he was playing bagpipes outside, and oh, don't get me wrong, he was he was nice looking. So he had the cult and all that on. So Matthew's been like to me, ask him if he's a true Scotsman, right? And I'm like, uh, I'm not asking him that, you ask him, you're the one that wants to know. <laughs> he's like, I'm not asking him, you ask him. So I've turned around to the guy and I went, excuse me. And the guys looked at me, he's like, aye, and I went, he wants to know if he's a true Scotsman. It was raging. It's like he wants to know if you're a true Scotsman. The guys like that. That's for me to know. Nobody else to find out. (laughs) 
Um, did you find out? <laughs> no. <laughs> I was sitting there and it was quite windy and I was hoping it would blow his car up. <laughs> I don't know. He told me to ask for anybody else to find out, so he wouldn't show me. Yeah, don't blame me. <laughs> but he played uh, a couple of songs, so we sat and listened to a couple of songs and then we went and done the rest of our shop. I will need to have a catch up, Michelle, because I've got gossip and all that for you. I don't know what I'm doing on Monday. I might be going to Martins on Monday, so I don't I don't know. I'll let you know. But we'll need to catch up because I've I have caught gossip. Uh -oh. <laughs> I wish they would be sharing it, but it's just too funny. <laughs> Obviously, I can not see it on here, so we'll need to catch up. We tried to chat yesterday, but obviously I had to go out and all that, so I didn't get much of a chat. Mm. Well, that's good, Nikki. Come along well. It's cute. Yeah. It's kind of looking pretty now, isn't it? Yeah. Kind of. Kind of. I'll try and message you all something tomorrow when I get up and see if we can have a quick chat before I go out more because I'll probably not be going out to like the back of the van to the hook. So if you're up then we can have a chat before I go out. This is like the message for it, wasn't it anything bad? <laughs> She was she's waiting for that message asking if he, if he was. You just asked me at all. She's yeah. deleted. There was people where I was like, a uh, woman trying you know, like getting pictures took with them and all that and all. I didn't have my phone with me, I'd have a good one took. <laughs> right, okay. Well, once I get up and that'll give you a message and that and we'll, we'll get catch up. I go out. You probably need your headphones though. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, <laughs> thank mm, So, <laughs> oh man, crazy. Yeah. Yeah, you'll definitely need your headphones. It's got to be something rude, folks. <laughs> I don't have headphones so the kids don't hear. <laughs> it's so pretty, Nikki. Thank you for sharing. Have a good night. Good night, Debbie. Oh, hey, Debbie. Deb. Deborah. Out there, Have a good rest of the evening or sleep if that's where you're off to. <laughs> Have a nice time zone. <laughs> yeah. 
It's so difficult, isn't it? <laughs> I know there's some else that I watch. She says, have a good day, a good night, and a good evening, wherever you are in the world. A good night, evening, and day. Oh, oh. Evening and night. Oh, well, oh, well, she just says happy time zone. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'll pass my dinner time, need to warm up then I'll be right back. Okay, Susan? Yep. The other Susan's pretty quiet. You still here? Yeah. I think she's whistling or something. Uh oh, wait a minute. Susan, where are you? You still sitting whistling? Yep. I think maybe. Yeah, I think she's left this. Oh no! <laughs> Someone else more interesting must have come on live there, I think. Mm. Treat her. <laughs> <laughs> I just tweak it. Yeah, I just had long spaghetti meatballs from my dinner. Maybe we'll cook them. And I don't know what to, I've got the money for one, but I don't know what to order a takeaway, so. Mm. I don't know, maybe she just fell asleep, but. I don't know. I don't remember seeing her say goodbye, so. Kind of stop talking when they, yeah. you know, yeah. she wouldn't normally say bye. Mm. Mm -hmm. The last thing I've seen, Phil, was when she was saying about the foil. Maybe she went off to order some. <laughs> Maybe. No, he's just done with me, Michelle. Sorry if I'm quiet, I'm just concentrating now. I've been quiet and all. I'm just yeah. trying to talk a bit now. You subject. Don't know what you're talking about. I said I would just ask Michelle how I stumbled this. Yeah. <laughs> 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 we could always talk about the weather. What's the weather like where you are? <laughs> mm. All else fails, talk about the weather. You see, I know I feel sorry for taxis because every time I go into a taxi, I always say, you busy the day? <laughs> You've been out long? Did your friend get rid of the kitten check, Michelle? Oh, yeah. Kitties. Well, she's decided she didn't want one, so. Oh. How could you refuse a kitty? I know. You could have joined the cool cat club. No, you're so hard hearted, Michelle. <laughs> right, she's a wee snoring, I know. She's about slow and tiny. What? Mm. Still has them. She still got them. 
Je weet het, ik ga snoren je, Michel. Zie je je wat hier? Je kunt op in chat en ik heb in chat gewoon aan. Je moet even keep in the chat going on the chat so I can talk to you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It was chicken day. Yeah. She felt that bad because she was known last week. She's like, oh, I feel so bad. I was like, we do feel bad. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, oh, fine. Miss yeah. Jane, but oh, fine. No, it's dead bad because she likes them. No, she didn't even like this them. <laughs> you can't make it. You can't make it. That's right. Some is still not great. I had tuna and crackers earlier, but it didn't help. Mm. Maybe try I don't know, something light. You might eat something light. I think you didn't drink plenty of water. <laughs> you should always have a glass of water by your bed. When you're not drinking. You haven't made a social life and I have, and I've no ego in it, Chris. It's unfair, isn't it? <laughs> I don't doubt when she comes over here, we'll be doing drunk videos. <laughs> yeah. When's she coming over? Don't know. We need to get your A into G, Michelle, so we can... Ah, uh, see, you should be drinking water, no tea. And drink water in between drinks as well. That's one thing I don't really do, though. Being drunk, but when I'm at the stage where you start feeling sick, man, it's like, oh, and it's like I can't even drink a lot in my mind. It'll be about three day hangover. That's I might do that. I used to drink three days straight, and now I'm like, one, one day, and I've got three day hangover. It's like, oh, that's when you know you're getting old, isn't it? Mm -hmm. When it takes you a week to get over uh, drinking. <laughs> Oh dear. I'm saving up to go. Saving up? Huh? Yeah, she's saving up to go. Oh. Not saying, saving. Well, she wrote saying? Saving. I'm playing catch up at the moment. Why are you playing catch up? You're just buffering, I take it. Or you mean catch up the other things? I don't know. Saving. Welcome back, Susan. Bye. That dinner sorted. What are you having for dinner? I mucked up his hair, so I'm going to just cover it over with tissue paper and try again. <laughs> Always like he's up. sitting behind a cloud. <laughs> yeah, I know the feeling, Michelle. I'm the same. I said I'm like no good. And then Matthew went in and checked the uh, the prices for the passports. Ninety seven pound. Ooh, bean and ham soup sounds nice. Homemade. All right, Pauline, thanks for joining us. Ha have a good night. Or day. Good night, Pauline. I 
need to get chicken so I can make my chicken and rice soup again. I'm going over to my brother's for dinner tomorrow, roast pork for having tomorrow. So I know what's on the menu and he's gave me some homemade lasagna, so it's in my fridge. Well, one's in my fridge because I'm letting it defrost and mm -hmm. I forgot to have some Monday's dinner. And then I've got one in the freezer. muted down the colour of his hair. Uh... Yeah. Yeah. Because it was too bright. Too bright. Too yellow. <laughs> so, yeah. It's knocked it back nicely. That's going to be on there like that. Mm. Yeah, that's definitely better than a shaker, I think. I like that. Mm. It's not that shakers are alright, but it's like yeah. if you're hanging it on the wall, you're not really gonna take it off to shake it. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say um that's actually what made me stop and not really put the shaker on is because it, it is going to hang on the wall. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah, it was a very good point. Yeah. Could my boo out for a journal or something? Yeah. In front of a journal. Because sometimes I take your fridge magnet off the fridge to shake it. Your wee ATC you made me the shaker ATC. Yeah. I take that off sometimes. You <laughs> Cute. Yeah. I'm going to tacky glue it, I think. I don't think I'm going to hot glue it. I think I'm going to tacky glue it. That would make a nice brooch as well, I think. <laughs> it's, it's pretty big. It's ah, pretty big. You know, it's a. Uh, don't know where my ruler is, but it's pretty big. I wish I was still into woodworking. Yeah. Mm, I was rubbish at it, but oh, I we haven't done a bit of woodworking. So we'd have made something for my mum's thing. Yeah, that's four and a half inches, this um, this rosette. So, uh, and this cross is, look at that, 11 inches. 11 inches by six and three quarters. So it's pretty big. And I've got my special um, little wall hanging there as well. Yeah, I use them sometimes as well. Yeah. Good way to repurpose. Yeah. So I have a, a repurposed cardboard. <laughs> and. Um, yeah, cardboard and then uh, so on the back of this one it's a gold doily. Yeah. Take a little while for this to um down properly. Actually, it looks quite good with both of them on there, but hey, hey. Oh. This gives me the opportunity to place it like so, I think. Is it like so? Still not happy with that chappy's hair. Might darken it right down. Might take it down and make it brown as well. Let's see. That's a red brown, wasn't it? Still don't like his hair. 
should never put yellow on there in the first place. Dark brown will be okay anyway, won't it? Yes, it will. Okay, then. Sorry, I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm distracted. I am at... just my message. It's okay, I am kind of talk, just talking to myself anyway, talking myself through it anyway, so. Yeah, that's better. Much better, yeah. Okay, that's that worked. I knocked it right back. So, yeah, uh, as Sue said, Rosette, she made last week. Yep. Yep. She, yep. she didn't make that one on stream, but she made the other ones, but that was one she made off stream. Yeah. It is. It is. These were the two I made on stream last week, and then I, I went and added even more to them. <laughs> when I came off stream, I added more. So yeah added more poofy stuff on this one <laughs> and I actually added more poof on this one too ah uh, nice yeah but they're, but they're going in a swap so uh yeah i thought on yeah i thought that as well susan because i'm sure you were done quite early in the stream yeah thank you so yeah i'm actually quite pleased with that it's got a lot of um texture and things on there which i think is cute and i'll put the uh put the little hanger on there too yeah. that is nice I like that and then call it a day. I I don't like that either, Kyla Goose put up. It bothers me that I'm looking online for some garden furniture and then sponsors or adverts for garden furniture appear on my Facebook. I don't like that either because it does it with me as well. Like if I'm on the, the website for the works, it shows an advert on Facebook for the works. I don't like that either. What I don't like is when you're just talking about it and then the adverts start popping up. Somebody's actually wrote that. Uh, you know, so somebody's commented saying, they are listening to us all the time. They yeah. attach cookies to your devices. It bugs me too. Yeah, I can actually just talk to my hubby about things when we're at home and then I'll start seeing adverts for it, you know? Mm. So you oh can't my. tell me the phones don't listen. <laughs> Do you ever watch Clive, Clive Power? He does a lot of covers as well. Clive, yes. You ought to see the amount of weight he's lost. He's just put a before and after. All right. A picture in his weight. Oh my god! <laughs> it's five percent weight loss. Week one to week four. He's only done it in four weeks. Yeah, he's on keto, is he? Oh my god, man, that's amazing. I don't know what he's doing. I don't don't know what yeah. he's what weight he's. Wow. Oh, he's he's on Weight Watchers. Weight Watchers, though, that's good. Good for Weight Watchers, eh? Mm. Oh, thanks, Michelle. Yeah, it's gorgeous. I love it. It's really pretty. Yeah, turned out well, actually, from what I was, yeah. My original idea, see, look, you didn't know. <laughs> These things evolve, don't they? Mm. Just like, oh. Yeah. I really wanted to put this one on there. <laughs> you know, right, I'm going to put that one on there, but uh, yeah, but not now. 
because it won't go there. Do you like to know what would look nice in that as well? What? Like beaded trim and the edges. Not, not sure. Not sure it would. Let's have a look. I don't. You mean like little pearls or something? Ah, you like run the edges of the cross. Have a look. See what I got. I think that would look nice as well. Yeah. Now, it looks nice with they just the black outline, but yeah. No. If you really want to, if you really want to shabby up to go with like the pearls on your rosé and all that. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. I've got this. Yeah, lace, the lace is too much, yeah, but I've got this, you see. I've got this one. Which might be nice, what do you think? Mm -hmm. No? Maybe. Do it on the outside, but I that's, yeah. that's what I meant. Like, do you ruin, like, ruin the whole outside of that? Well, just to get a bit of a border as well. It's up to you, though, but not sure. Not sure. I think I like it just with the black on there. Mm. But it's always good to just have a look, isn't it? Yeah. I might, I might take the pearls off there because they're dangling right down. So I might leave the bow on, but take the pearls off. Mm. Because, yeah, I'm not sure that pearls around the outside would be okay either. I like the black. I actually like the dangle too. <laughs> yeah, I like your dangle. Uh, so, hi ho. <laughs> but you don't know till you try, do you? So, mm. it's worth getting it out, just to have a look. And I've got this one as well. I don't have much of this either. That's too much. Oh, that's too much, I No, too much. That doesn't work. It doesn't work. No, I think it's okay as it is. Hi, hi. I do you have bling bling. Bling bling, bling bling. There's, other, there's always other ones. Maybe you can make another oh. one, make, have the three of them. The different styles. Mm. That way you put three. I could uh, bling it up. I could put just like tiny little bling around the edge. But maybe I'll do that on the next one. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe you'll join me making one next time. Um, I don't know, but <laughs> I tried. <laughs> <laughs> I almost caught you out there. Oh, no. <laughs> I might make a, I might make another alter C D because as I say I want to make like a couple for uh, Michelle and Joseph. So. Yeah. This is to Michelle that I would make her a CD for not often, so, so oh, I was going to do it the night, I was just screwed up if that's speaking to my brother on that, so like, oh, just... Yeah. Do you like it, dear Michelle? It'd be a, a nice one to do. Well, that's Michelle. She'll do it. Yeah. Cool. I don't it says, but you've got the template we have now. <laughs> okay. Get the template. <laughs> yeah. If you do do it, um, it'll be good to prep the cross first so that you don't that you don't spend the time prep you know cutting it out and everything else just prep it first 
as I say, that's a big one, 11 by, what was it, 11 by? That's a subtle way I say you take too long. <laughs> Don't you? She's even laughing. She's not denying it. Wow, well, you know. <laughs> that was cruel of me to not say that loud. <laughs> uh, yeah, cereal boxes. I used a uh, cereal box and I did six layers. That's why I had to prep it beforehand, you know, because the gluing and, and everything else. And um, and then I gessoed it both sides and it ended up being quite sturdy. But I've, or, I've wet it again, so I've just got to wait for it to dry before I can peel it. Now you can just use a couple of that actual cardboard, corrugated cardboard. Yeah, I think you can use whatever you like, but that that's what I use for that one there. Yeah, you can... Um, you can finibar it up to your heart's content. This is so hard, so true, though. I'm so <laughs> I'm slow, too. I'm a slow crafter. I'm not a fast crafter. I'm quite a fast crafter. I just don't like going dead slow in my projects. I like to get it done and dusty and get it out of my mind. And that way I can get another project done. Yeah. Yeah, cool. Right, time to go then. Now mm. I've finished. <laughs> so I just want to say thank you all for joining me this evening or this morning or this day. <laughs> Is that better? Did, yep. I cover, did I cover all bases this afternoon? <laughs> yeah. This night? <laughs> oh, dear. Anywho. Thanks for watching. Thanks for joining in the chat. Appreciate it. And see you all again soon. Bye. Bye.